Police in 43 Division announcing today that two projects has resulted in 406 charges and has taken more than 20 guns off the streets in Scarborough. In total, there are 48 persons arrested and 11 of them were young offenders. As well, 11 of those 48 people were already bound to firearm prohibition orders stemming from prior convictions that they had on their record. I'm pleased to report that since the seizure of all these firearms, we've noticed a marked decrease in gun violence. In fact, we've only experienced one firearm discharge in the month of July and only one in the month of August. So far this year, there has been 307 shootings in 43 Division, which is a 44% increase from last year. This prompted the creation of Project Community and Project Springboard, which removed more than 20 guns off the streets. Most firearms, how they get here um, is shocking, but the fact that we have got this many totaled in the past four months is, is what's really shocking. Um, the origin of them and how they get here, there's other units that look at that holistically. Of the 48 people arrested, 16 were out on bail, which again speaks to continued cries from police services for changes to bail reform. Investigators attend every bail hearing when there is an arrest made and a firearm recovered, we, are, we strongly advocate for detention orders to hold these uh, armed persons in custody once they're arrested. And while many of the alleged offenders do end up receiving bail, Toronto Police has implemented several strategies to hold those on bail accountable. We mentioned our newly created bail compliance unit. We have officers that are out every single day checking on uh, these parties that are on bail, enforcing their house arrests, their curfew, meeting with their sureties, ensuring that they're following the rules of the home, and we're laying additional charges if there are breaches made. Uh, there is new technology being used with GPS monitoring. Toronto police say that there has been 29 gun-related deaths so far this year, but none of them were in 43 Division. All of the 48 arrested during Project Community and Project Springboard have made their first appearance in court. In Toronto, I'm Brandon Rowe for City News.